Hey guys, this is Tatolyong, and in this video, you will see 10 things that you should abuse more in Dora 2. Whether some of these tricks are bugs or not, they have been there for a really long time, so it is time to learn the art of magic. Number 1. Tasca Stack Team is one of those spells that can secure you easy kills very early in the game. As much as you want summons to work with Tasca, it doesn't. Imagine having 6 range summon constantly hitting you with Tech Team on. That's not very fun to play against. But if Tasca purchased his own Necrobook, the tech team somehow worked and since Necrobook hits so fast, that is a lot of damage and a lot of solo queue potential against tanky cores. Magic. Number 2. Have you been in a situation where you can't keep track on where your enemy is going to get glimpsed to? I have a solution for you. Start with Thunder Strike and glimpse the target on the third tick of the Thunder Strike. Your target will always land on the first tick of Thunder Strike, no matter how they juke you, no matter where they go, no matter how far they go or how fast they go. You can use this to precast the Kinetic Field and Static Storm. Magic. Number 3. The return damage from cheap vest is physical damage, which means that it can be amplified by minus armor. Alchemist Acid Spray does AoE minus armor, so holding a cheap vest on Alchemist is very good in the early game and can speed up his farm a lot. Number 4. The scoreboard is obviously the most important part of the game. A good score means that you're a good player and a bad score will generalize you as a feeder. Here is how you can get assists without even coming close to dying. Spells like Charge, Corrosive Haze, or Track will give you an assist on your scoreboard even when you are nowhere near your enemy or even when you did absolutely zero damage to them. With no deaths and high assists, you are a good player. <coughs> Magic. Number 5. Remember the fountain hooking Navi? That doesn't work now, but here is how you can take buildings without committing your hero. Teleport with Nature's Prophet and shift cast the Meteor Hammer. Punch then hooks Prophet at the very last second of the TP and there you go. Damage the buildings without being there. Number 6. On 10 things you should know about Dora 2 episode 7, we learned to take down Roshan when we are AFK with Monkey Agonims. After you took down Roshan, Monkey King can turn into Roshan himself, so you can scare the living crap out of your opponents. Please note that you move extremely slow in the Roshan form. Yeah, you come out still Roshan or not? Right, I come out. Okay. Hello. Oh. <laughs> 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 go Roshan, go! Go Roshan! <laughs> Magic. Number 7. When Morphling steals Rubik, he will get hold of the spells that Rubik has stolen. Keep in mind that the stolen ultimate will not be stolen by Morphling, else Double Ravage is gonna be pretty dumb. But what is not dumb is how Morphling can switch Rubik's switch spell by switching back to Morphling and then re-switching to Rubik. Number 8. In my 30 things that you should know about Hoodwing video, I show you how you can do bushwhack into a con shot by using max distance. However, casting the spell like this might not be the most reliable way to do it because the spawn tree will take more time to spawn. Instead, cast it like this. Placing the tree at the other end of the circle is definitely a more reliable way to execute the combo. Number 9. Getting off pools are extremely important on the safe lane. When you do not have a stacked small camp, you can do a double pull and that is when you bring the creeps from the big camp to the small camp. But most of the time, the position 4 player will stop you and you might even die trying to get it off. Here is when you want to do a half pull. You can reset the entire wave with a single half pull without stacking the small camp. 
A half pull is when you aim to kill one range creep and one melee creep and that will eventually cause the lane to push towards you because the small cam will be able to take out one range creep and one melee creep easily. The timing to pull is at 18 and 48 seconds. For Radiant, drag the creeps down then walk left. Do not take any hits from the neutral creep and walk away from the range creep. For Dyer, drag the creeps to the southwest direction. Do not take any hits from the neutral creep, then walk towards the southeast direction as the range creep gets closer. Number 10. When you're chasing the target with static link, you are forced to attack the target constantly without any animation, which means that you don't need to stop to attack. If for some reason you don't want to attack the target, for example if the target has blade mail on, or if you're stealing damage from an illusion and you don't want to kill the illusion until you reach maximum damage, you can use the stop command to stop attacking the target. But if you're chasing while spamming S, it's gonna look really awkward chasing while stopping randomly. This is where you can use the directional movement in your settings to chase without attacking the target. Speaking about Razor, check out this Razor magic trick. Magic. Razor had just released the Kraken V3X. It has amazing bass and treble sound quality, bendable mic with noise cancellation, lightweight and comfortable, and most importantly, it comes with the magic trick. Magic. If you're looking to complete your setup, I will also recommend the Razer Black Widow V3. Not only is good looking, has a satisfying click to it, but it is also extremely tanky as well. The keyboard is aluminium constructed and the keycaps are built to withstand your keyboard smashing when you walk into techies mines. Upgraded keycaps are also available in stores, links are in the description. As I said in my previous video, I'll let you know how to do the spinning trick in the next video. Thank you for staying to the end of the video. If you enjoyed my Dota content, do hit the like, share, subscribe, share, like, subscribe, like, subscribe, share, subscribe, like, share, share, subscribe, like, or subscribe, share, and like. And I'll see you in the next video.